What do you mean you left it on the counter? I thought you were bringing it. Oh, well, this is just wonderful. I handled the gift for Cadence and Shining Armor. You were supposed to do this one, remember? Well, we can't just come to this wedding empty hoofed. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. He always cries at weddings. <laughs> Usually, it's not until the wedding starts. These flameless fireworks look even better than flowers. <laughs> Attention, every pony! Our friends have done it. They've defeated the bugbear. <laughs> hey. Hello. So, uh, you didn't happen to mention our earlier conversation about my secret identity to any pony, did you? No, I did not. And you're not the only one with a secret, you know. You know those expensive imported oats you were saving for a special occasion? I cooked them up and ate them. All of them. <laughs> it's sort of thrilling to reveal your deepest, darkest secrets. <laughs> That's what best friends are for. Next time, you can just bring your own gift and I'll bring mine. Fine. There you are! My suit has vanished and this was the only thing left in my closet. How do I look? Like a million bits. Great wickering stallions! Look at the time! We'd better get inside. Allons-y! I can't believe I lost my hair! I look ridiculous. The love of my life deserves better than this. Have no fear, Cranky, my dear. It's Stephen Magnet's mustache to the rescue. Oh, thanks, buddy. Oh, no problem. Now you get in there and marry that donkey. Well, is every pony here? Set Mayor! Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to join these two in matrimony. As I look around this room, I can only imagine how uncomfortable Cranky must be. <laughs> but I also see so many ponies from all trots of life, brought together by love. Cranky searched all across this great land of ours to find Matilda. And no matter what obstacles kept them apart, love would finally bring them together, just as it has brought all of us together now. It's remarkable to me how a story like Cranky's search for Matilda could fill this room with such a unique collection of ponies. It makes you realize that every pony is the star of their own story. And it's not just the main characters in our stories that make life so rich. It's every pony. Those who play big parts and those who play small. If it weren't for every pony in this room and many more who couldn't be here today, Cranky and Matilda's lives wouldn't be as full and vibrant as they are. <laughs> and so, in front of all these loved ones, Cranky... Do you take this donkey to be your lawfully wedded wife? You bet I do. And do you, Matilda, take this donkey to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Then I'm proud to say, I now pronounce you Jack and Jenny. <laughs> You know something, girls? We are so lucky to live in this town. I love you all. Ow! That's where the bugbear bit me. Sorry. 